Joseph, you too. Welcome to the coffee pod. My name is Chishi Zed. Drink the coffee. It'll make you feel better. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Don't chase women. Really? They'll chase you. Is that your strategy? Yeah. Does it work? Works very well. <laughs> <laughs> Look, no woman is going to be happy with you chasing a all the time. Like, all yeah. the time. I'm not yeah. talking about in the beginning when you guys are coming together. I'm talking about if you live your life chasing a woman and showing up at her doorstep and having flowers and shit and violins and, you know, all that shit, you're killing yourself. Now, man, let me tell you something. And this is on the, the, the back of the Will Smith situation. Mm -hmm. um, it is neither your responsibility or your fault if a woman cheats on you. Okay. Yeah. The relationship is not going to last. The reality is you, when you buy your way in and you become a provider and you just become like a like you represent provision, that's not the same as being sexually stimulated. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Like out. representing provision and just being a guy, yo, I'm going to buy you a bunch of shit. Yo, that, that's weak. I've always felt you're a, a natural ladies man in the sense that women really love you. The women I know who know you adore you. And you always seem to have a, a natural affinity around women. Would you accept that? Yes, yes. I, I, I absolutely adore women. I just do. I, you know, I'm a mama's boy. I, I absolutely love women. Uh, but you know, I also have uh, an abiding respect for them. I think that's that's what comes across more than you know. I'm not what you would call a ladies' man. No. You know? I'm not a real big skirt chaser. You, you look, Will Smith is one of the most successful men in acting that ever exists. Uh, the brother's a good brother, um, absolutely lost. But when you go down the emotional rabbit hole of a woman, you'll never survive it. I learned in my first marriage, and some in this one, you cannot compete with women when it comes to emotion. Mm. We were not built that way, you will break. He See a guy, find, a guy that, a guy, nobody guys that again. use money, guys that use <laughs> money, never guys that use again. money to to sustain their relationships and use money to get their way in. That's, yeah, that that's me. That's, that's weakness. Me. Fuck, yeah. It's weak yeah. because you don't believe in you enough. Yeah. You you try no, to use man. money. Yeah, yeah. You see what I'm saying. Money, the money is an exclamation mark. Yeah. The money makes you more of whatever you already are. Yeah. But you got to bring something to the um, a small time skirt chaser. There is a secret. I will <laughs> tell you. After the show. <laughs> Come on, what's the secret? Don't chase women. Really? They'll chase you. Is that your strategy? Yeah. Does it work? Works very well. <laughs> I'm going to get in trouble for saying this because... How do, so expl explore this technique for me. So what is the technique of letting them chase you? How do you make yourself known as potentially available? Do you understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. They can handle a level of emotional baggage and and amending that we can't. So, listen. Don't hold yourself responsible for your woman wanting. A, a woman will always want more than you give her. Right. I don't give a damn it. Listen. If you don't believe me, first of all, look at Will Smith. Go back and look at, look at, compare the careers, money, and everything. Mm -hmm. You can't. Go back and look at, uh, you can't compare many men to, to Will. Go back and look at the richest man in the world. Amazon owner. Mm -hmm. his, his woman is staring in the face right while he's right there, staring at Leonardo DiCaprio. Mm. A woman is something about them that always desires more. It's not your fault. Mm -hmm. Okay? How many times you been married, Mike? Three times. Three times? Yeah. But that's that. It's my mother's love. That's what you want. That's what we want. Any woman that we associate with because they remind us of our mother. Even right. though constantly. Yeah. Right. Right. Yeah. She could be educated, but could have been slept, but she had the personality of the mother, something about her. That's the only reason I like you anyway, because I'm attracted to my mother and you had that characteristic. Right. My first love, I fell in love with her because when I, if I got sick, she used to console me like my mother. She was the only motherfucker. Listen. It, it heal me like my mother. Mm. And it would not this ain't no no sex. This was just on some Listen, you know. listen, I know you said no sex, but know why it didn't work? 
because of sex. You know what I mean? We look for our mother and our lover, but our mother could never be our lover because our lover would never love us like our mother. She's not in her, it's not in no woman to love us like our mother loves us. It's not in her. Don't care how much a slave she is, don't care how many people she fucked for you, bring you the money. It's not in her to love you like your mother loves you. Eventually she'll oh, turn her man, back on you. That's crazy. Eventually she'll turn on you, nigga. You treat her like a <laughs> dog, you she turn on her. Love her like your mother loves you. That's no. the song. Yeah, listen. <laughs> listen, hey. It ain't in her to love hey. her like your mother. Hey. Now listen to man that's some real shit Short sure, sweet people listen real quick it's time to talk about the sponsor of today's video and it could be you hear me out if you enjoy the content produced here on the coffee pot you can support by drinking coffee through one of my handcrafted coffee mugs right here i've talked about this before but i haven't gone into detail about what exactly goes into this coffee mug what you see written around the mug there all the different taglines from the coffee pot everybody knows the drink the coffee it'll make you feel better and and women <laughs> along with <laughs> God damn it. You can't make this shit up. so I first start with the plain black mug for your project then I clean and prep the mug so I can add my beautiful handwriting listen guys I'm a podcaster not an artist I try my best I then use an oil-based marker to write all the different taglines that we all love from the coffee pot and once that's done and hopefully there's not too many mistakes but it happens a lot. I leave the mugs to dry for about an hour. That's when I begin prepping the art resin, which I would then use to apply and seal your custom mug, the outside of your mug. The resin works great to protect the writing once it's cured and firm. The curing process usually takes about 72 hours and then bam, the resin is fully cured and firm. And finally, after four days, your custom mug is ready to be packaged and sent directly to your doorstep. In other words, for less than $2 an hour, I will handcraft a custom coffee mug for you and you get to support the channel. Why would you drink coffee from some boring mug from some random store? And the worst part is they probably don't drink coffee. Hit the link pinned to the top of the comment section and get your custom mug today. Click the link pinned to the top of the comment section to get your custom coffee mug today. And please do us all a favor and don't bitch about the price. Just don't do it. Don't, you know, you, you meet a lady, you express to her how wonderful she looks or how you respond to the way she looks or whatever it is, and then go on about your business. And does it ever fail? Curious, you know, they're like horses in a pasture sometimes. <laughs> you walk into a pasture and the horse, horse sees you. He's coming over to investigate. And if you, if you see a lady and you, you don't go... You know, drooling all over it, she's going to want to know why. So you've basically a lifetime of non-drooling has been a successful strategy. Yeah. Yeah, it works fine. It's just like us, if we're being honest with women. We've allowed women to cause us to lie to the point that we tell them them means we love them. Mm. We screw Drink the coffee, it'll make you feel better. Them up. Mm. When we truly know sex is just a dump off to us, we might love the woman, yeah. but why don't we love every woman we have sex with? Mercy. Because it's just a release for us. Right. Okay? And we've been taught to lie. If you lie to me, mm -hmm. I remember literally the first time a woman made me tell her I love her to have sex. It was I was 16 years old. I'll never forget it. But here's the thing about it. Don't allow yourself to go down that rabbit hole you can't handle. It. And it's not your fault, your woman flirting with other men, mm. looking at other men. Mm. Just know, whatever you can't handle, get the f away from. Yeah. Okay? Look, I look at my that's wife. That's why you can't, I man. I Nigga, think that's no. why she could. I look at my wife. They don't take you, my, listen. Both my my ex wife. Oh, Mike, I gotta wait, hey, Mike. I gotta run, Mike. I gotta tell somebody that. No, you ain't listen. That's why, I, bro. No, I'm gonna tell you. It something. wouldn't in her to love her like my mama loved me. Mm -mm, that in her. Yeah, it wouldn't in her. <laughs> it wouldn't in her, man. No, why? No, why? Because her survival. Even though she do, but her she does everything she does for you. Listen, everything she does for you is for her survival. Everything your mother do for you is for your survival. 
Now listen. Now listen. That's great. Listen, can I tell you something? It's not over, nigga. Right? I just want you to know it's not over. This is to all young men. Listen to what I had to say. Don't date a woman just for her looks. You don't want the best looking woman. Trust me. The best looking woman, so many dudes, you wouldn't believe it. Mm. They just know how to hide it better and they know that somebody's going to want them later on. Don't play women's games. Play your game. If you want good advice, you know, my, my dad told me a long time ago, never worry about women. Focus on what you got to do. All that will take place. But I'm going to say it a different way. Unless the women play your game, don't play with them. Become intolerant of stupidity. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah. Hold on. Drink the coffee. It'll make you feel better. All right. If you want to know the the, the time, and, and, and this only equates for this reason, the time that Mr. Reed got more in his life than he's ever, than anybody in the world's ever gotten, is when I didn't give I didn't care about what you were talking about, uh, what you were going through in life. I don't care about none of that. Are you going the same way I'm going? Hmm. If you're not going the same way, I'm going to stop waving down, me down. And when you become like that, you'll get the one you want. Because you realize, let's be honest, you may want to f- every woman in the world, but you can't tolerate every woman, bro. Trust me. You need one. And that one, forget about how good she looks. If she can't bring you money, she's not your woman. Do you understand? Your goal is to go out and kill, bring home and eat. Your wife's job is to look for places for you to go and kill what you need to kill to eat. And to lay the path out for you. And to help you cut it and lay it out and cook it. Her job ain't just to get her feet done and get facials all of them. Like you see these dumb ass ball players and all these other these rich old white men just getting pretty women. No. You gonna marry somebody, marry somebody that, that works at a hedge fund. You know, if you gonna if you're gonna give a woman, you know, a million dollars, give a woman a million dollars that's gonna bring you twenty or thirty. If the woman you with ain't making you no money and y'all just smiling and, and Netflixing and kicking it, that's why they don't respect you because they doing what you're supposed to be doing. Get on your job and stay. All right. Um, listen, guys, as always, I'm curious to know, what do you think? Comment down below. I appreciate you for checking out yet another episode of the Coffee Pod. Till next time, come out. Peace. Peace.